your girl has a bow in her hair because first of all i'm just a girl it's cute okay your girl got this color i got white i think that's it um but my two you know go to so perfect this is so cute okay um love this so the reason i have this in is because i'm getting ready because i'm about to do baby girl's four month old pictures she's getting so big you guys like i can't believe she's already four months old <sighs> to say that your baby grows fast and like not have a kid and people be like oh yeah i heard they grow fast like no no, no you really don't understand they really grow fast like i'm literally living proof like She's growing so fast, like my heart is so full. It's just crazy. But yeah, so we're getting ready. She has on, the, she has the cutest little dress on. Um, if you want, follow me on Instagram, underscore queen of everything with two Gs, so you guys can see the photos. So yeah, your girl's been preparing, okay? Because my birthday's tomorrow. Then the birthday activities start Sunday, then they're just gonna carry on throughout the month, okay? So your girl's been preparing, but I did get in some things uh, from Sephora, so. And some lip stuff, but I don't know where that is, but I'll just show you what's in front of me really quick. So I got the Fenty Beauty new highlighter. I think it's that's rich color. I already used it earlier. Hold on, let me try to clean it up for you. But I already used it earlier. This is so freaking pretty. Like, I don't know if you can tell really because I have to like finish, but this is really, really pretty. Like, so pretty. I was gonna put on lashes, but for this picture I'm doing with her, I think the no lashes looks fine. Because it's just giving, like, natural mommy and me vibe. Like, it's just giving cozy, you know? But cute. So, I'm not gonna worry about putting on lashes, but this is so pretty. The reason I got this is because I want it to look like the base of the bronzing for me. So, I really like this. Fenty Highlight never disappoints. They came out with the St. Bart spray, okay? So good, your girl had to get another one, okay? Literally, as of last night, ordered another one. This came in yesterday, sis. When I tell you, this smells so freaking good. <sighs> yes, okay. So, your girl got the new spray. This, I'm telling you, this smells so freaking good. Like, I have the body cream. Mmm, smells so good. Love it. Let's get into the shoe haul really quick. I feel like all I have time to show you guys is accessories. So let's just get into that really quick because um, baby girl is here with me. So I'm going to speed through this really quick. But I picked up some cute like accessory things like whatever to go with some outfits and stuff. Um, outfits, I don't think I have time to show you guys. So you'll probably just have to wait to see when they pop out on the gram. These are so freaking cute. Steve Madden did their thing with these. These are fire. They're thick quality. They're good. I love these. So this was a really good find. I cannot wait to wear these. These are going to be a statement piece this summer. I'm not sure if I want to do like a casual type of like little fit with some cute like colorful shoes or like do like a kind of like pool beach type of fit with this. But I got this cute knitwear bucket hat colorful for spring this eats okay this is so freaking cute but the thing with me is i think i would roll it up one because when i tried it on i think it looks cute when you roll it up just one because of how long the band is but this is so cute okay just imagine with like some colorful pairs of shoes you ain't gotta do too much then have the cute bag and all that okay just wait on it so cute right and then for shoes i got these these are so cute like, I love the colors of them. It's just like a white and then like a silver. But these are so cute. Like, I went back and forth if I wanted these or not. They have them in pink too. I think I'm going to have to cop the pink because these are fire. Like, so comfortable too. So we have these distressed denim type of sandal. Denim this year for sandals is very much in. And Coach has some cute ones or whatever, but I don't really want my sandals to say coach on them i love coach purses through and through there's actually a few i plan to pick up soon but um i don't want the denim to say coach i just want it to be like distressed looking so when i seen these i was like oh immediately check out how fire are these and it's like a black dark denim so they're gonna go with so many little fits i love these with the gold hardware on them sis so freaking cute and then I wanted a black cute pair of shoe with a little bit of Sherpa vibes. These are so cute. So I found these. I already wore them like twice. So cute. So comfortable. Love these. Such a vibe. Ah, I love this bag. Such a good find. Like I'm so obsessed with this. 
I love the color, love the way it feels. I love how much space is inside of it. Truly, it's such a cute bag. I have quite a few outfits that came in for my birthday that I really wanna show you guys, but I realistically just don't have the time to try them on. And then my birthday's already loading this weekend. So, I don't know if I'm gonna have time to just pick up the camera to show the fit, we'll see. But regardless, I plan to do pictures, so you guys will see it over on IG. Whatever outfits don't get worn for my birthday, they're gonna get worn for something else, so don't worry. I'm about to go edit baby girls um four month old pictures and then post them all right since your girl's getting ready yesterday was my actual official birthday but today is the day we're like doing a ton of stuff for it um yesterday was just chill vibes by cabana pool like just relaxing um it was so nice baby girl was so good we spent it with like my older sister and um family and stuff so that was nice that was nice and then today is like girly vibes like let's go out so let's get ready um i probably won't do a full get ready with you guys but uh or soon you here so good news your girl pumped enough milk enough is frozen i told you guys i was had to drink coconut water like it was my job so i froze enough milk so today your girl is having some drinks too okay like yeah <laughs> yesterday was such a good day it was like so nice, so relaxing. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, but yeah, so it's like eight something in the morning. I am tired, I'm not gonna lie. I don't wanna not be in my high spirits because I feel tired. So I definitely um, want to, you guys see this pimple? Oh my God, it just came on yesterday, it's so annoying. But anyways, I definitely wanna be in like high spirits. So I um, am probably gonna have a coffee today and maybe an energy drink or maybe just two coffees. We'll see. Maybe my energy will just magically appear. I was up late trying to figure out um, what I was wearing <laughs> because as I told you guys, your girl's cycle came on. So I definitely don't want to wear the cream stunning dress I have. Like, unfortunately, it's not worth it. It's not worth it because I know it's going to get ruined. Like, I just, I just know. Like, I would have to literally, mm -mm nope mm. so that's just gonna have to be for another time so i'm like kind of mm, bummed about it but it's okay whatever um just not gonna chance ruining that and i'll just have to be for another time but yeah i think it'll be okay um so i think i'm just gonna do like a hot pink maxi dress type of vibe that you tie knot at the top um and then i also have a really nice restaurant vibe we're going to for the evening and that's gonna be separate. So I don't know, I think one of them I'm gonna do like more girly casual with like a cute bag, some heels, some jeans, and then like a cute top. And then the other one I'm gonna do like a dress vibes. Like, so I think that's what I'm thinking um, for everything going on today. Yeah, so I'm not gonna overthink it because I was up late trying to overthink it. I was so mad. Like this dress issue is really, it really matters, but it is what it is, I'll be fine wearing makeup um like actual makeup like foundation foundation not just skin tint is like hey sis where you been at it says i'm in the car with my mom and my sister and we're going to make the um lipstick and lip gloss and then my other sister and her um best friend are meeting us there but yeah such cute vibes pinky pink girl vibes my mom looks like a super goddess it's so pretty we're gonna take pictures and then i'll insert them and stuff and then i'm gonna probably film on my um phone with the tripod in the place when we get in there but yeah that's the update i got ready but i couldn't didn't have time to show you guys the actual outfit because i had to go but you guys will see more later Okay, so now that I chose the color, she gives you everything to lay your base. Now, the color of the base that you see here is not the color of how it's going to turn out necessarily. So she said there's a lot more that goes into it as far as adding in, you know, your scent drops, everything like that. There's a lot that goes into it. I highly recommend checking this out. I got a lip gloss, so that's why there's this space right here for like a smoothie type of vibe. And then in the end, she gives you the option to choose a little lip gloss um, bottle and then you'll put it in there. Oh my god, this is stunning. Do you think it's too bright? Like, I should do a little bit more muted? Let me see. Let me see. For every day? I cannot. I mean, no, I like it. I don't, 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 I don't
Yeah. Trinity, I wish I got your face in the right. camera. <laughs> that was, those guys are hockey. I love that all right, so yes, we're at the next spot. We're at um, this really nice restaurant, so I have to be really quiet. Um, but yeah, it's such vibes. I got me a chocolate martini. So good. Say hello to the vlog. Right. <laughs> Sephora getting this old de Janeiro discovery set it's sold out everywhere I just came in here they're literally not on the shelves so she said she's going to the back to get it so this we secured it so I just got back from um, Whole Foods getting the cookie butter latte coffee it's really good I added extra cookie butter which I think is good because it's a really strong coffee so I do advise if you don't want it to be like overpowering just like with no flavor maybe add in a little bit extra I don't know it's my opinion but anyways, it was really good and it's really worth it literally that whole large was like I think six bucks or 540 something really good anyways um i picked up this this is one of my um birthday gifts shout out to hubby because literally baby girl and i were like um in the car and stuff and i was like i want to go find this discovery set i don't care if i gotta go to bad different stores but of course i don't want to take her into um sephora so he was like it's fine like let's go we'll just go see which one you can find it at and yeah so anyways i got it i'm so excited let me tell you right now it is sold out everywhere around me like i'm talking there's like five sephoras in different areas around here gone like this one i had to go into a cold sephora to get it but the other cold sephora that's like um 20 minutes away that one sold out too so i got really lucky and when i went in the lady was like yeah there's um they're supposed to be on display here let me go look and then she was like oh i guess they're gone somebody bought them this morning I was like well i called you guys earlier and i asked if i had to hold and she was like no, no no it's fine i have some in the back like it was no big deal so when she came out she literally came out with three she's like oh here you go i said no i, I just wanted one she was oh, okay i didn't know some people come in here by a bulk i was like no i just wanted one like because <laughs> i already have the 68 spray because that's my favorite scent so anyways i never smelled all the other ones really so let's smell them together so this is sol de janeiro 87 okay i love this this is giving like i just put on tanning oil Ooh, i like this a lot okay so let's smell that one i, I don't need to smell 68 I literally have the bottle i've had multiple ones of that one all right let's smell 62 hold up Yep, yep. This might be my new one. What? Was this fun? Because I mean, if you, I literally have never smelled all these. So like for me, it's fun. Okay. This everyone keeps talking about this one. Let's see. Okay. Okay. I think I like it. Okay. it smells good um the 62 i like more but this one this does smell really good i would layer this i would layer this for sure not just have it by itself but i could see if i layered this with the right scent how it would smell really really good to me so so far i'm in a conundrum because i was like oh i can get like because i'm doing um i want to do like a mother's day basket for um my older sister so because every year i always do something for mother's day for her because growing up gonna get a little personal real quick um me and my mom would butt heads really bad so my older sister was like a mom to me growing up like she was my go-to for everything so um like i always do stuff for my mom but like my mom's not really a gift person because my mom literally has everything like <laughs> my mom's successful so um 
yeah but my sister my older sister like i always like to do something cute and like you know stuff she wouldn't like normally just go grab herself but she likes you know my friend likes this one let's see if i like it now okay okay this one's not bad either hmm so I'm in a conundrum because anyways, when I got these, I was like, oh, I'm probably going to put one of these in like one of the baskets for her. But instead, I think I'm going to, I told you guys I ordered a second one of these. It just came in. I went to the actual store for this, but this one just came in the way one. Um, I think I'm just going to give her one of these. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think I'm just going to gift her one of these instead and keep these. Because I feel like I can layer these all for different times and then give her one of these because I had I just got one and then I got another one. So yeah, I think I'm gonna keep these. This set was only $38, I think. Is it 40 or 38? Maybe it's 40 or 38. I don't know. So, anyways, for you get five of these. So that's a good ass deal. Like, and they're good sizes. These are perfect for if you're traveling or especially because summer you know what i mean if you're traveling or if you just want something ongoing your bag i think these are freaking perfect sure it was so much fun making the lip gloss and everything um i don't even know if i got to finish showing you guys but it was such a good time it was so fun i loved the whole atmosphere vibe there and i loved when they taught when you're making lip gloss like the way we were like explained everything was so good and i did record it i'm gonna try to see what i can put in this vlog like this is editing me talking because there was music playing and i can't like ask her to turn off the music there <sighs> which sucks because i wanted you guys to hear everything bit by bit because it was so interesting like it was really interesting how we could do it so i don't know what i'm gonna be able to put in the vlog about that in the beginning like sooner than this so let me just fast forward here um pretty much when we were making lip gloss you can literally choose like what you want in it so if you want to put like lip plumper spf more moisturizer anti-aging like there's so much that can go into you making lip gloss i thought that was so fire and different and then you get to choose your scent um and that was so good because she lets you smell the drops of the scent and everything to see what you really want there's so many different scents to choose from i choose cappuccino because i'm such a coffee girl through and through it smells so freaking good also, the cool thing was, there's different scents. So if you're not a girl who wants to lick her lips and taste it, you can get certain scents that don't have the flavor on your lips, like when you taste it, but then it has the smell. So there's different categories for that shit. Like that, it was just very detailed and very awesome. And like the lady's really nice. Like she's really cool. The owner works with you through it. So they set candles as a vibe, charcuterie board, um, instant sangrias as like, you know, um, complimentary when you come in then they have a wine champagne charnay list too um i think they only charge like eight nine dollars per glass or you can do like a bar thing if you want um and that just depends on like how big your party is my party was a party of five people but i didn't know what everybody wants so we kind of just did our own thing and again you do get complimentary sangria um so yeah it was it was really really nice i really liked it and then um, we actually did end up going to a really nice like steakhouse place um, that's new. I had really good vibes. I had a chocolate martini. Sis. Sis. That shit was so, so good. So good. So anyways, I think I'm going to be on my martini kick now because that was so good. But then they tell me they had the espresso one. And I was like, why didn't nobody tell me? Because now I want one of those. So it's okay though. My sister used to be a bartender. So she's like, I'll just make you one. Um... <laughs> Cause it was so good the only thing is i didn't know that vodka was in it and i'm not really a vodka girl because when i was growing up i was out here in these streets uh throwing back vodka like it was nobody's business and um yeah i'm not really a vodka girl because of that i kind of grew vodka so that's the only thing i don't really care for vodka but i couldn't tell there was vodka in it so yeah so it was such a good time, felt really good, and then we got really cute pictures and all that, so dinner was a vibe, that was a vibe. We almost went and all got tattoos, we literally drove deep in Orlando to a tattoo shop. We were all gonna get tattoos for like my mom, to symbol my mom, um, but when we, <laughs> when we got to the tattoo place, you guys, I'm not even kidding you, they were showing us their work and we weren't loving it and it's crazy because they were five star reviewed so i don't know if it was just the artists that they had available but that's what you get when you want to do a last minute tattoo and i've never done that so besides when i was like 
turning 18 or whatever at somebody's crib so <laughs> i'm telling you i was in these streets when i was younger but anyways um i was just like no i don't want to do that like and the pricing was crazy for what we wanted and i was just like no i'm good like if i'm gonna spend that much i'm gonna get something resembling my daughter not that so my mom was really blunt and she told the lady straight up like is that supposed to be a butterfly because it looks like a moss and the lady was like, oh, I think it was a moss. How do you not know? Aren't you the tattoo artist? No, thank you. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good to go. You're not getting my business. So for Mother's Day, my mom got me a cute little ring. And, it, and you twist it, like, for, like, if you have, like, you know, anxiety or you're feeling nervous, you can, like, twist it. It's really nice. And it says engraved in it, um, something like forever my friend or always my daughter forever my friend or something like that it's really cute we all got different sayings engraved in ours um and then she got everybody a five minute bible study journal for less stress life so this is so nice it's so cute my mom's always done stuff like this for christmas time um she like gives everybody planners and like you know um budget books and everything so like you know everybody can always budget their stuff and everything but yeah, she thought this would be nice, so you kind of read it, you understand the scripture, you write down your devotion for the day and things like that. So she got everybody these, because she thinks it's important that we all have one of these, because growing up, my mom always did stuff like this. Um, and as we're all getting older, you know, she's like, you know, tap into that. So I think this is really nice, and I'm excited to get into this. Um, this is something I will do personally on my own, though. Uh, so I'll let you guys know, like, how it goes, but... Yeah, I think this is really sweet and nice. So that was my mom's Mother's Day gift is those rings for everybody. And then everybody got their own Bible study devotion book. So yeah, it was such a good time. But I was just updating you guys. Again, I'm exhausted. I'm going to tell you what. My freaking room is a mess. There's clothes everywhere because as I was getting ready and packing and everything, there was just, sis, it's crazy.